Здорово! Ну что ж, продолжаем вампира. Так, итак. Итак. А, я нашел ожерелье. Сейчас я покажу, где я его нашел. А, ба -ба -ба так. Ожерелье. Здесь вот. Я забыл, что здесь можно вот так вот хренась. It's locked, all right. It's locked, all right. Так, и вот здесь э, на трупах э, было ожерелье. Э, теперь, теперь, теперь. Блин, нога что-то заболела. Так, вот колье. Маленький бумажный ярлык. От Сэмера любимой матери Стелли. Так. Короче, среди трупов я нашел окровавленный это. Я даже не знаю, <coughs> что мне сделать. Давайте мы поговорим а, вот с этим сначала уродом. Узнаем. Может он какой-то маньяк. Yeah, yeah. Так. А, это отличный вопрос. Рассказать о найденном подарке и телах. Так это, возможно, он и мочканул того чувака, который там валяется на дороге. Сейчас. И это же не значит, что я ему сразу отдам, правильно? I have retrieved the gift for your mother, sir. Great. Give it here then and take this for your trouble. I also found the corpses. The ones under which you left the necklace. Сэмэр убийца рецидивист. Эй, Сэмэру, пожалуй, пизда. Have you no remorse? You don't even deny your crimes. I have many weaknesses, Dr. Reed, but lying about who I am ain't one of them. You're not a mindless animal, Seymour. Surely you have something to say about these murders. Speak up and I will listen without judgment. Could be right, Dr. Reed. Maybe it'll do some good to confide in a gentleman like you. You being educated and all. Damn. Tell me about your victims, Seymour. Who were they? Why them? Was there a link? Why should there be? They just kept getting on my nerves at the worst times. That's all. How many? How many victims? It's not like I keep records. It happens when it happens. Бля, пиздец, я его вот уже кокнуть хочу. Блять, мне надо уровень вот срочно. You feel nothing. No empathy for your victims at all. You seem pretty calm yourself, don't you? We're not talking about me. That right? Well, our calm's the only thing we have in common then. No, bleh. Did you take pleasure in killing them, Seymour? All those people, all those lives extinguished. I take no pleasure from it. Just gives me peace. Stills the anger. For a time. This rage you feel. Have you ever been able to control it? Resist it? I... I tried. For my mum, I tried for her. Telling the truth made me feel better. For a while. Так, still относится к 
Стелла способна сдерживать ярость Сеймера. Don't you think you should seek help? Talk to someone you trust, someone who cares about you. No. And don't dare speak about me to your colleagues either. Keep your mouth shut tight, especially about my mum. Why is your mother protecting you, Seymour? I'm her son. She's the only one who knows me. Sometimes I think she knows me better than I know myself. I understand you love her, but can't you see the awful situation you've put her in? Do you think my mum would have a better life if I were dead? She seems so sad to know me sometimes. Death is an appropriate punishment for your crime, Seymour Fishburne. Cherish every day that you spend as a free man. It might be my mum's wish that I end up swinging from a hangman's noose, but she wouldn't want to be the one who ties a knot round my neck. Так, Стелла не хочет доносить на Сэма властям, поскольку ему грозит смертная казнь. Goodbye, Mr. Fishburne. Где там твоя мама, блядь? Просту, да? Ты нахуй слышишь? Просту, да. Так я уже забыл. Так, этих у меня... Good evening, Mr. Throgmorton. Doctor. А что я бы такой тот типа чувак вампир? Goodbye. And good hunt. Good evening. What? Goodbye. Этот тоже бомба, но он себя это сам убьет. Good evening, Mrs. Fishburn. Of course. I'm not sure the epidemic is what worries people most these days. It's a chechno. What can I do for you, Dr. Reed? I'm chechno. Tell me about these demons. Seymour needs your help to fight. <clears throat> Seymour used to be such a happy child. And he is still a helping son most of the time. But when he gets angry, he can hardly contain his rage. All men and women are born innocent, Mrs. Fishburne. But there can be a monster within any of us. Do you think he can be cured, Doctor? Do you think something can extinguish this rage inside my Seymour? Человека полон загадок, здесь поможет лишь правосудие. There is no cure for murder, Mrs. Fishburne. Only justice. There ain't no hope then. Somehow, somewhere, my son has turned into a monster, and nothing will bring him back. Stella, I know you are ashamed of your son's crimes. So why do you protect Seymour? I can't report my own son, can I? Not a burden I could bear. Burden? 
How do you mean? They'd hang him for sure. I won't send my only son to his death. The situation will only get worse. Someone has to stop Seymour. If someone ever found the courage to speak to the police, I will take my share. Your son's gone way beyond simply bullying people. He has a taste for blood, and you know it, don't you, Stella? One night, he told me straight up, in his own words. It was several days after one of his episodes. Why did he confess? Did you suspect something? No. I guess he wanted his old mum to help him fight his, uh, demons. Did Seymour tell you everything that night? More than I could stand. The words he used to describe his... hate, his rage, how he feels when he's done it. Ah. Мне нужен... Goodbye, Miss Fishbone. Take care of yourself. Please don't stay too long, sir. Ты за меня, ты не переживай. Мать. За меня ты еще переживать. Так, где этот вот у нас находится? Господи, куда пойти? Ага, здесь. А тот поближе, да, был? Да, этот поближе. Надо с него это начнем. Так, мы к тебе еще вернемся. Evening, Rufus. Evening. Evening, evening. So long, Rufus. Да, давай, давай. Good evening, Mr. Yeah, yeah. Ты вот, мразь. Блин, один уровень мне бы сейчас... Goodbye, Mr. Fishback. Вот один уровень, серьезно, я вот сожру. Сначала вылечу, а потом сожру. Чтоб опыта больше дали. Сюда. Хера 22. Я же его не одолею. Блин, вот же жесть. Вы все-таки жоперные. Ой. Ой. 
Да блять! А, вот уперся ты в эту вот стену сраную, придурок конченый. Блять, суки. Блин, в принципе, у меня были шансы его за. Крыш теперь жрать мне. Спасибо, блядь. Да вот же ешь их. Да. <coughs> Не очень-то и ты крутой ты оказался. От дробача особо тебя ничто не спасло. Так, монеты. Так, и сразу, сразу, сразу. Господин, так говоришь. Угу. Где-то здесь. Да что ты? Ох, 
Давай. Все, сдохни. Так, пока ты где-то здесь. Так, это довольно незнакомо, да? I can't believe I'm doing this. Забрать нет, они мне нафиг не нужны. Нет, нет, и нет. И нет. Так. Так, как мне попасть наверх? О, не наверх, а вон туда. тоже закрыто да неужели я... через основную так ну то сходим сначала алкоголя дадим Welcome back, Doctor. What can I do for you? Так, терпера. You lied to me, Tom. Your warehouse wasn't empty. It was inhabited with armed vigilantes. I'm sorry, Doctor Reed, but I thought those Prewin guards would be willing to let someone like you pass without trouble. That was devious of you, Tom. Next time, you can bloody well go yourself. I apologize, Doctor. Bad. It's just that I prefer to avoid the law, its enforcers, and all manner of thugs in uniform. Так, Том, старайся избегать столкновения с законом или полицией. Ну, 
Так, надо с ней еще насчет письма поговорить. Here is your booze. I hope it will appease your customers. Just try not to kill anyone with this poison of yours. <laughs> Believe me, Doctor, most of my customers are less agreeable when sober. Так, 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 так. Что еще тут у нас есть? Так. You attempted murder. Give me some details. I was given an order. An order to kill. I was an obedient gang member at the time. A proud, wet boot boy. Why did you join the gang? Because I finally felt useful. Do you have any idea what it means to feel respected when the rest of the world shits on you? So you were ordered to kill someone? What happened then? I don't know if you can possibly understand, but... I couldn't kill him. I just stood there pointing my gun. Someone saw me. I gave up. Why couldn't you shoot? My target was eating in that fancy restaurant with mirrors and music. He was eating, drinking, laughing. He was having such a good time. I hated him for his bottomless appetite, an easy life of easy pickings. And then something happened. You realized what it means to take a life. You feared what it would be like to carry that guilt with you. Believe me, Doctor, I wasn't scared. I wasn't even afraid to face the wet boot boys after I'd failed. Mm -hmm. Tell me about your arrest for attempted murder, Tom. I tried to kill someone. I got arrested. I paid my debt and I have nothing to hide. So you mean your customers know about your sordid past? Yeah, why do you think this is the last pub open? I have nothing to hide and I don't judge. That's a relief for many round here. Do you think prison changed you? Made you a better man? Oh, I don't know about that. All I brought back is bad memories, scars. <laughs> and an ugly tattoo of a blue turtle. But do you feel cleansed of your sins? All I know is that I'm at peace. I did what I did, but I wouldn't do it again. Does that make me a better man? I don't know. Why not leave town and start a new life after you got out of jail? I grew up in the East End. This is where my roots are. This is where I want to help others and die eventually. Dad. Do you think the docks will always be a hive of scum and villainy? As long as poverty and fear run the show, I don't see how it would change. Misery loves company, as they say. Don't you feel threatened, staying in such a violent and criminal neighborhood? I've made peace with my violent past, Dr. Reed. I may not be a pacifist, but I'm not angry anymore. Sure, Tom. Так, uh... Sabrina seems very fond of you, Tom. I like her too. I really do. I know I'm her boss and I'm much older and all. But I like her for sure. What is bothering you then? Sabrina is an angry one. She wears it like a coat. I'm not sure I can make her shed that anger. It hurts to see her like that. Goodbye, Mr. Watts. Так. Times like these, a good drink's just as likely to cause a problem as to solve one. You can see me now, Mom. You're still working at this hour. That's what I call dedication. Так. Were you aware of Tom's past incarceration? That's the first thing he told me when he offered me the job. He didn't want me hearing about his past from anyone else. Did it surprise you to find out about it? Not really. I was already aware of his reputation before I met him. 
That's why I came to the turtle in the first place. Most people would have run away because of that. Not me. I thought a man like him could give me stability, you know? At least to some degree. And I wasn't mistaken. Dab. Tell me, Sabrina, do you really believe Tom has renounced his life of crime? He proves it to me every day he tells the truth. Tom Watts is a good man. One of the best. And you don't think he might fall back into his sordid ways? We can all do terrible things, Dr. Reed. And we never know what we're really capable of until it's too late. Sabrina, tell me about your true feelings for your boss. I love Tom. Not ashamed of it. Don't care if the customers joke about it, neither. There. Who's mocking you? I mean, we're always together. People will talk, won't they? Does Tom love you? Yeah, but he's always reluctant to take it further. It's not because I'm younger, or because of the colour of my skin. He hates jokes about us. Ну, я тебя горчу, но нет, не поэтому. Нет, ты не угадала. Ай, блядь. Goodbye, Miss Cavendish. Мне между вами, что ли, отношения еще настраивать? Идите вы в жопу, сами разберетесь. Welcome back. Goodbye, Mr. Wall. Все. Так. Все, пошли по сюжету. сюжету так нам сюда по сюжету и я Seems like the guard of the free one is on short hands trail too. Kill it all you deserve! Back in the crowd! Ты бы не хотел нахуй пойти. Иди ты нахуй. Смотри, они все прут и прут. Прут и прут. Здесь 
дерьмо еще какое-то. А! Просто бред. Так. Что тут у нас? 40. 40 магазин 9, да. Ну, пока, значит, возьмем пистолет просто. где-то что-то как-то обойти можно, да? Здесь у нас нет ни хера. Немного-то у нас путей. Так, здесь могу подняться наверх. какие-то дома где там уже не доберутся их там уже захерачили здесь прям двор какой-то чей-то Так. Ну это шопа здесь какая-то. Ч так много ходов тут?
Да, блядь, промахнулся. Они там прям толпой развлекаются. Да господи, блядь! Да, блядь. Господи. Вс, хана тебе. Бля, нихуя. Да, 
ты... Беги ты, уебывай нахуй. Наверное, много чего пособираю. Блин, капец тут всего. Я не понял, что ты. Что там? Что-то непонятно он говорил. Так. Ну это и так очевидно, что он не настоящий охотник. Что ж там? Так, вниз я пока не пойду. Внизу там пиздюлину точно я выхвачу. Ага, иду домой. С какой стороны-то возможно? С вот этой. Внизу там дети бродят, да? По улице. Ну, конечно же. В 
вон они. Не, против них я не думаю, что у меня есть на это. Вообще, хоть какие-то шансы пока что. Это вот та дверь. Есть так, опасно ближе, чем кажется, они уже здесь, они здесь, тропыры. Расклеить пять плакатов, сжечь плакаты. Теперь их могу расклеить. Или же сжечь. Так, а расклеить их как? Как их? Это что у нас? А, то есть в этой области я могу их наклеить, да? Здесь надо наклеить. Или, или где? как наклеить а как сжечь пока я вообще не понимаю куда нахер клеится вообще Может эти наклеить, а вот это одна сжечь. Ладно, давай сейчас прогуляемся, посмотрим. Ух, ух, ух. Ух, уж эти. Байт у чувака разобрали. Вообще жесть. Просто жесть.
Два неизвестных. Так, я даже не знаю. Please, Come and have a gander. На его товары, да? Там в доме. Ага. Все, но, блин. Понятно. Я хочу понять, где мне их клеить. Ух ты. Здрасте. Так, я хоть... Ну я же на точке. Так тупо. Yes. 
Так, так, так. Так, где мне вешать плакаты эти драные? Один смет. А, -а, -а во. На такой стоечке. Понятно. 25. Вот они. A double or a triple agent. Блять, а ты посмотри их там сколько. Да. Чертовы с коты о о о о вкусно Так-то. Так. Что у нас там значит? А, значит, возвращаем нам дробач. Ух ты, 8 патронов. Гася, шикарно. Так, теперь мы разговариваем здесь двумя. Чё? Он О, у вас еще и был вверх путь. Бух ты! Вот оно где. Угу. Кровать. Пока нам не понадобится. Чё, часы можно разобрать. Не надо, не надо. Мусор. Давай. Так. Может, нельзя. Нельзя. Да. О, револьвер можно. Улучшаем. Так. Стрельбы, оглушение. Угу. 
Так, лекарства. Окей. Так, ну здесь два неизвестно. А где этот? Тортон. Еще одно неизвестно. Блять, а где он? Я не могу его найти. Ладно, поговорю с этими ребятами. Good evening. I'm Dr. Reed. Do you need any help? Rest assured, I will help you, sir. Martin Nightingale, at your service. Please, take a look at my wares. <laughs> your merchandise. I don't really see anything worth having. No offense. None taken, sir. But please. I need to eat. Perhaps if you keep looking, you'd see something that takes your fancy. Так. I'm looking for Sean Hampton. Can you help me? He's a caretaker for the poor, is he not? Something like that. Yes. Sorry, I don't know where he is. Let me be frank. You're as much of a businessman as I am a werewolf, right? Who the hell are you to question me? 
It's hard enough to stay clean when you don't have a place to sleep. I'm doing my best here. I meant no offence, Mr Nightingale. I was merely pointing out the fact that you're unlikely to survive long if you continue wandering this path. And what should I do then, sir? Should I join the wet boot boys like so many others? No thanks. I'd rather be a bad seller than a dead gang member. Так, может быть, все стать не нечистым на руку торговцу, чем спить в банду. What can you tell me about the neighborhood? Have you got any friends around these parts? Not really. Miss Gillingham smiles and says kind words, but I know she's lost her marbles, especially since her son died. Tell me about this crazy woman. Madness is often mistaken for other conditions. <laughs> the poor woman's mad, all right. Kind and all, but she has so much trouble remembering things. She's taken me for a son more than once. Так, и нет, порой принимает Мартин за Джека. Так. How interesting. I don't suppose you know what happened to her son. Jack, rumor has it he tried to tackle some gang lads. I didn't know him well, but. I heard he was a nice enough chap. His old ma still thinks he's around. Why not try seeking help instead of peddling your wares? I'm sure there are people around here that would gladly help. There's always the night asylum. I heard it's run by a very nice man, but I'm no beggar. Not yet, at least. There is no shame in asking for help, my boy. Sometimes it can even be the best course of action. I don't feel okay with that. I'm going to make a name for myself, and I'll do it by myself. Show me what you have to offer then, Mr. Nightingale. Чем он барыжит, ты посмотри на него. Я уже взглянул твои товары, спасибо. Иди в шопу. Good evening, miss. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. May I come in? I already took my medication, doctor. Uh, but thank you. I'm sorry. Your medication? Have we met before? Don't tease me like that, Jack. Sorry. What? I think I should come in, miss. I'd like to check if everything is okay, what with the epidemic spreading across London. An epidemic, you say? How terrible. I had no idea. But where are my manners? Please do come in, Doctor. You... you are a doctor, yes? Yes, блядь. Doctor, my doctor. Я так понимаю, это сундуки, которые у них в этом. Родник бежал бив одного из членов мог пойти. Д. 
Да сколько вас здесь, блядь? So, I told you my name is Jonathan Reed. Don't you remember? Of course I do. I remember my name too. Gillingham. But you may call me Enid, Doctor. I'm very happy to see you again. I'm looking for a Sean Hampton. Do you know where I might find him? Sean Hampton, you say? Oh, the name does seem vaguely familiar, but alas, I, I cannot recall from where. What can you tell me about this part of town? Oh, no. I don't gossip. That would be most unbecoming of a lady such as myself. Is anyone taking care of you, Miss Gillingham? My son is always here to take care of me. He's a good boy like that, but... I do worry that he needs to start living his own life. I would never say that to him, of course. Who are the more influential figures on the docks? Well, I heard about some terrible illness going around. I would say in that case that it's you, Dr. Tippetts. Блять, вот папка тупая. Какой тебе Tippetts? Goodbye, Mr. Да, да, давай, пошла. Так, раз мне это не нравится, что тут у нас расследование? канализации это куда мне блять под вашим пиздовать какую канализацию хера это где это в каком ры это на нас здесь я не знаю в канале какой блять так вот ты придурок Так. Забавно. М -м, так он может быть... Здесь же тоже, да? Точка расслед, да, ну конечно. I have this thirst for blood. I can't believe I'm doing this. Не, ну а ч он за упырь вот делал? This 
is despicable. Good evening, miss. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. May I have your attention for a minute? Good evening, sir. My name is Giselle Paxton, but I don't have time for men like you. Have we met before? No, but I just need to look at your fancy clothes to know that you must be desperate to visit the docks at night. That's quite judgmental of you. Sir, I've led enough strikes when I had a job to identify you as an enemy of the working class. Um, uh, I'm sure. looking for Sean Hampton. Can you help me? What is it you want? Does he owe you money? Has he displeased your royal highness? I'm no snitch, Mr. Fancy Pants. May I ask what you do for a living? I'm killing myself scraping for a living. And you? Have you ever had to struggle in your entire life? As I told you, I'm a doctor. You have to work a lot to earn that title. Oh, a doctor. Born with money in a nice house, were we? Was Daddy a banker or a doctor himself? Why such hatred? Are you judging me by my clothes and my job? Of course I am. Fuck, you're so blind. You don't even see your privilege. Lazy people like you disgust me. What can you tell me about this vicinity? Tell you what, just spend a few weeks here and then ask me that question again. If you're still alive, I mean. If you have something to say, say it. I'm getting tired of all this. Oh. You want information instead? Well, here's some for you. Giselle Paxton does not like you at all, Doctor. You don't know me, Miss Paxton, and yet you see me as an enemy. Oh. Your manners, your clothes, your words, tell me everything about you, sir. I know your kind, and you don't belong here. Oh no, Miss Paxton, you really don't know my kind. You have no idea who I am. All right, okay. No need to get all worked up. You speak of strikes and class enemy. Am I right to assume you're involved in trade union activism? You bet I am. Well, I was. Nowadays, I'm just another worker blacklisted by the big companies. You lost your job because of your beliefs. Those bastards really hate a worker who refuses slave wages and unsafe conditions especially when it's a woman. Isn't the whole point of trade unions to help workers in need? Why don't they support you? A few nights back, I lost the money my companions had asked me to hide. With me and my sister being penniless, they thought I stole it. What really happened? I drank too much that night. Так. Ходила. Strange men saw me count the money in that bar. Some sort of militia in uniform. I'm sure they robbed me. Well, I'll leave you for now. Goodbye, Miss Paxton. Так, что она дала мне новое расследование? Куда мне валить надо? Good evening, miss. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. Can I help you? A fancy doctor lurking at night by the docks. <laughs> Not fishy at all. And what about you? Working outside at night in this dangerous part of town. You want to know my secret? I'm trying to earn money. And I'm Lottie Paxton, by the way. 
I'm looking for Sean Hampton. Can you help me? Mr. Hampton must be in his office at the Night Asylum he manages, I suppose. Why do you want to see him? He was a patient of mine at the Pembroke Hospital, but he left abruptly. I see. Well, Mr. Hampton is a discreet and dedicated man. I'm sure you'll find him soon enough. Is it not dangerous to work here at night? As long as I have good legs, I can run away from trouble. The sad saint now provides me and my sister a bed and a roof. I don't want to lose that. Are you homeless, Miss Paxton? Mr. Hampton's night asylum is our new home now. It's a safe place for me and my sister. What can you tell me about the sad saint? It's just the nickname of Sean Hampton, the sad saint of the East End. He gave me shelter, and he is not always sad. What can you tell me about this place? How are things here? It may be okay for a strong girl like me, but a dandy doctor from the city like yourself. You better watch your back, Mr. Reed. You really yeah. think I should go back to a safer place, miss? No. I think you had better stay and help as many people as you can. Just avoid the wet boot boys. Those bastards are worse than the epidemic. Which local dangers must I avoid? Well, the gangs, the thieves, the drunks, the jobless. A man with your fancy clothes will attract a lot of attention. Well, I am not someone so easily intimidated. Glad to hear that. And if you get into trouble, you can always seek help at Sean Hampton's shelter. No one would dare to be violent there. Кроме него самого, да? Goodbye, Miss Paxton. Да, Miss Paxton. Goodbye. Так. Старая газета. А это вот как раз старая газета. It's locked. It's locked. Так, мне сюда, но я пока туда не пойду. Я сейчас еще прогуляюсь. Схожу, вернусь, возьму там это трофей. Так, мне кажется, уже до хренича времени это прошло. Сколько я уже бегаю? Часа два, наверное. Так, ладно, на этом закругляемся. И так уже до хрена пробежал. Так что давай, счастливо тебе.